Hey everybody, Dragon of the East Blue once again, and I'm bringing to you another episode of Naruto Fails of the Week. And uh, before I get on with this episode, I just want to say I have a special message at the end of this video, so please watch the video in its entirety. Now that I got that out of the way, let's move on with Naruto Fails of the Week. This is week 27, chapter 561, The Power in the Name, which is actually a pretty cool chapter title. Is this chapter any good? Is it a fail, a pass? I'll spoil it. It's actually not that bad. Alright, well, now we learn that the attack that Madara was charging up was actually a meteor, which is nothing really new, but it's still pretty cool. And since it's Madara, I'll give it a pass, because this guy is just probably the most badass character we've seen in this whole series. And um, we actually see the Iwakage doing an admirable but futile attempt to try to stop this thing from falling, because he's just flying in the air and he's using a technique that makes rocks lighter, which I think is a little too convenient. But uh, just to help him out, Ma uh, Gata is there. And stops it. Mother's like, hmm, not too bad, but, um, and drops another meteor on top of them. And the Kage's back in the tower are watching us going, what the fuck? And Tsunade is just like, we were played for suckers. And the reason for this is because since the very, very fucking beginning, Madara, uh, if he was really in charge, and the rest of Akaskiti have been planning this shit out. They've been planning it for years, and they know all the weaknesses and everything is going pretty much according to plan for them. So, for them being played as suckers, is probably the best way to explain it. Finally, though, Tsunade is going to be playing it the way that she should have been playing it. I really don't think she should have been Hokage. I really think she should have been just a really powerful medic nin and just trained more medic nins. Therefore, they all have really her ability of healing to keep more of their soldiers alive. And now she's actually going out to go do some healing, which is fucking what she should have been doing in the first place. But anyway, like I said... Iwa Kage is just fucking down and destroyed, and Madara is pretty much in the background just watching this, just going, hmm, this is pretty easy so far. And he then begins talking with the, uh, one of the, I think it's the other Iwa Kage who is being possessed now by, uh, Kabuto, and he's asking questions like, you didn't really die, did you, in the past? You gained something. And he actually gained something from the fight he first had when losing to, uh, Hare, uh Hashirama. And, um... Is it possible that this body, even though it looks like the other uh, zombies, shall we say, in the Naruto series so far, it's possible this might be his real body. He actually might not be dead at all. This actually might be just his immortal body. There's just a similarity to the revived state of these zombies. So this raises some questions. But um, getting on to more interesting things, the QB is pissed. He can smell Madara. He's like, where is he? He's like charging the cage. He's just getting pissed as shit. And he just wants to know where Madara is because, you know, this guy fucked with him and QB's going to fuck him up. Madara's getting pretty bored, though, uh, without seeing the QB around. So he's like, hmm, all right. He just charges out these massive trees. Because I think he gained some sort of uh, wood ability, unless he was able to control wood along with pretty much all the elements at the same time. And just attacking them, and they're just like, this is the end. Nato knows it's the end, it's over. But Kubi is here to save the day. He's like, Nato, take my power. Like, you want my body now? Not that, you gay fucker. I'm saying we have to kill Madara. I hate this bastard, and I will give you all the power you need. Just destroy him, got it? I hate that bastard as much as you. And at this time, I'd rather have you being the one using my power than anyone else. And I think at this point, Naruto learns, or maybe just looks at Kyuubi in a different way. Maybe a little bit of respect, because, you know, they can't see eye to eye. And this is really something that should have happened a long time ago. But it does happen. And, you know, it, the feeling is mutual, because the QB is pretty much grinning like a motherfucker. Like, he's having a good time. He's like, go, Naruto, just destroy for me. Do it. And he's having a good time, and though it's still overpowered, I think, Naruto, not the QB, because QB is very underpowered, but it's a pretty impressive just how those two actually started working together for once. But Naruto's at his limit because though he isn't human, his body still isn't really atoned or actually tuned in properly to assume or take on demon abilities. But that's pretty much the end of this chapter, so is it a fail, is it a pass? I, it's just, well... It's not amazing, and it's not terribly bad either, so it's getting a pass. It's actually pretty decent. You see, you add a villain like Madara, and everything goes fucking swimmingly. Now, getting on to what I, the announcement I wanted to say. Um, I will not be uploading anything for another week, and the reason being is because I'm not going to be here. I had a lot of stuff I wanted to upload, but I won't be getting the chance. Um, I want to upload a Halloween special of Rant. We're going to be talking about the Supernatural. 
since it would be a good topic to talk about on Halloween. But unfortunately, I don't think I'll have time to record it because tonight, here in Montreal, I'm going to see John Cougar Mellencamp. Uh, if anyone actually remembers who that guy is, give me a thumbs up. And uh, so I'll be seeing his concert. Won't be getting home until really late. Then on Friday, I'm taking off for a hunting trip. And, uh, well, I will be getting that on video, actually. So I will be uploading some of that. If it's not your thing hunting, do not watch the video. Do not thumb it down. Do not come in contact with it. I don't want to have to deal with haters. I've been dealing with haters for the last couple of weeks. And hunting haters, I don't want to deal with you guys. So that's going to be uploaded maybe f uh, Monday night. And maybe Tuesday I can upload uh, maybe the uh, the rant episode if I can get it recorded. Or maybe I'll just have to make, do a major upload when the next Shonen Jump chapters come out on Thursday. Because on Wednesday I don't have time to do any recording. So it's going to take a while. But anyways, I hope that won't bug you out too much. And I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. So this is Dragon of the East Blue saying Ceylon and enjoy the fails.